What's going on guys, it's Criticosis Gaming and we're doing a recording of the next uh, assigned quest, uh, Land of Convergence in Monster Hunter World. Uh, I'll not be doing a stream this time, I'll be doing a record for time constraints so I can get to Master Rank as soon as possible and start streaming from there. So, um, the next quest is the final high rank quest, which is the last monster in inverted commas, the um, Xenojiva. Yeah. So let's head on to the quest. And see what they have to offer. Yeah. Just got on with my trusty HPG, which is Pierce, and it should easily uh, beat Xenojiva, as it's quite a large monster. And normally, I would prefer using a ranged weapon, uh, you know, taking it on. So talk to the handler and accept land of convergence. Sinojiva right. uh, is the um, big bad dragon, which is actually the whole cause of this mess by um, attracting elder dragons towards the um, the other recess by emitting. Uh, energy from the crystals uh, are surrounding it. So, yeah. So, yeah. Okay, so where's the seeker? Yeah, it's down there, yeah. Okay. This is not the final form of the Xenojiva, it's still an infant stage. Uh, further into Master Rank, they will unlock this um, siege quest for the Safi Jiva, which is the adult version of the Xenojiva and uh, similar playstyle, I guess. Yeah, except that you can actually solo this one and you can't really solo Safi Jiva. It takes a long time. Yeah. So it's a cutscene. It's weird looking at Mr. X playing my handler. Well, he seems happy. So yeah, these crystals are the ones that are forming and I think it's formed by Xenojiva or something like that to attract Elder Dragons uh, to come here and die so that Xenojiva can absorb their energy and uh, grow big and be powerful, I guess. So that's the thing that's causing the um, migration of Zoranagdoros, uh, the appearance of Nergigante and uh, whatever Elder Dragons that come here and die. Blah blah blah. The fight is pretty straightforward. Uh, you just need to. There are two phases. The first phase is uh, where he just walks around the room and shoots laser beams and stuff and charges towards you. Uh, the actual real fight begins in phase two where he starts flying up and he gets charged up. And that's where you need to deal enough damage to stagger him and aim for his chest uh, till the glow disappears. So yeah, definitely a pierce weapon, uh, range weapon is really good for this. In fact, if you have the uh, dragon piercer build from for the bow, the critical draw build, that time it was the best one to fight him because it just deals so much damage to him and he can actually potentially cut off his tail. Yeah, and it's one of those quests that appears randomly uh, as a two-off in interim quest, you know, like the Zeromodorus, and you have to actually farm him because most of the end game builds uh, for high rank uses uh, Xenojiva armor, especially range, right? The full set gives um, free elemental up. 
I think and spare shot, a uh, spare shot, not frills, but spare shot, which is important for the uh, HPGs and LBGs. After this, there will be a long ass uh, credit cutscene, which uh, I'll just leave it running as it is. Yeah, we're not sure how this uh, Zinojiva came to be. It just appeared from in the ground or something like that. In the first area, there are two um, environmental traps you can use. You need to have slinger ammo equipped first, or if you're using a um, range weapon, you can shoot it off. But make sure that Zinojiva is right below it before you loosen the rocks. But yeah. Looks like some alien looking dragon thingy. And it's a bitch. Do the easy stuff and leave the hard one for me. Screw you. Okay. Awesome. Watch out for his tail, especially in phase two. As soon as he hits his tail down, he will erupt the ground with uh, energy. That, that's one of the traps right there. See, the other one it's further there. That one. And the one right here too. I lead him towards this area here and try and drop some boulders. Oh, crap. that was close on him. It helps to have some far caster with you. So you can return to base camp to reload or whatever, take a break. No, take a breather. Right. It's right there. Yeah, gotcha. Those borders deal a lot of damage to him. So much for being greedy. You need to, uh, for Blade Masters, you need to aim for its legs. Whereas for range, you should aim for its legs and its chest and its head. Because those are his weak spots and then you will most likely not bounce, you know. If you hit those and you deal like the optimum amount of damage. Mental on. Okay, this is where the actual real-ish fight starts. 
I need to really watch myself here because I can potentially get one shot because my armor is actually still high rank. See, I'm not dealing much damage to him yet because he's not enraged. That's when you actually should deal the bursts of damage over. Yeah, as he does that, the ground erupts from energy. It's, there are telltale signs when he's going to get enraged. He will start to glow really, really bright. And his tail is definitely severable, cuttable, how you want to put it. Crap, I'm oh, stupid. It's in such a weird angle. Oh no. Okay. I don't think he can be put to sleep. Yeah, that laser is dangerous. Especially when he shoots it across the whole screen. Yeah, I like so too. <laughs> yeah, but you can. I think, yeah, you're able to mount him. So the key to this fight is just to keep moving around. Yeah. In your face, you little bitch. It's a bit impossible for me to break his head right now. Oh. It's actually doable. Okay, yeah. Okay, see, he's he's getting enriched it soon. Get him glowing. That that's that's when he's enriched in that heal. Yeah. So if you keep dealing enough damage to his chest, he will fall down like so, giving you an opening to deal as much damage as you can, and uh, possibly breaking his head. Yep, yep, I managed to break his part of his head. Ouch. Yeah. He's still enraged. Stupid. After a while, he will start to fly up in the air. Yeah. So that's when being ranged has its benefits. Yeah. You can actually shoot him when he's airborne. Okay. Right. I just rolled into the wrong angle. And he can't be flashed as well. Nothing like some good old sling or some shots. Crap, why am I in PS2? No, that was close.
Oh, okay. They almost got me. No, you got me, you got me. Oh, oh that was close. Okay. This stupid fucking bitch. Yeah, that's dangerous. That move is dangerous. I don't think I can eat you. No, just pissed. Yeah. Okay, gotcha. Oh, oh I killed it. Okay, that was <laughs> simple. Right, and you can like, carve um, Zinojiva six times. So don't stop you know, carving after the fourth time. Yeah. So you have to identify him first. So you can't really make any of his armor yet after you need to finish the cutscene, the ending credits first. Yeah. But I'll be farming him much more. Definitely much more. I might even make the bow to farm him using the Dragon Piercer build. But we'll see how it goes. Because farming him using that way is much faster than uh, any other melee or, you know, uh, melee weapons. In fact, using the HBG is quite fast. I actually managed to down him in what, like 10 minutes? Apart from dying, yeah, so it's like 10 minutes, that's okay. It's not too bad. But Pierce definitely works the best. Mainly because he has. Uh, such a huge body yeah but anyway uh, enjoy the closing credits I will just turn off uh, live commentary right now and um, welcome to master rank I guess thank you for watching thus far I'll be continuing after the um, credits so enjoy the monster Hunter world closing uh, cutscene and credits in a way but yeah また君やりとけましたね。私たち。ドラマグダロンスからと面白い<笑> 
どんな苦境も越えられる気がするんだ。他者の生体エネルギーを集めて孵化する。そんな存在が新大陸にいたとはな。奴はより大きなエネルギーを得るために、老齢のコリを呼び寄せていたのかもしれない。もしかすると、一種のフェロモンのようなものかもな。こうして。大きな養分が苗床となり、長年かけて強靭なモンスターが育ってきた。流血症の地に古流が現れたのも同じ理由だろう。何にせよ、あんなモンスターが外へ出たら、何もかもが危ういところだった。本当にご苦労さんだったな。いいんだ。君が持っていてくれ。みんな集まってくれギルドより編書が届いた古竜渡りの解明実に見事貴殿らの報告を受けギルドはかの古竜を完全新種と認定しゼノジーバと名付けることを正式に決定したこれにて古竜調査の任務を完了とし貴殿らの帰還を要請する長きにわたる調査ご苦労であった<笑><笑>しかし、新大陸での調査は非常に有意義なものである。もし調査続行の意思があらば、その旨、検討してほしい。とのことだ。この地に残り、新たな調査を行うことは、さらなる苦難の始まりでもある。さて、希望者はいるかな
ましたね。待っていましたよ。これからもよろしくお願いします。さあ行きましょう。身体。正門前に調査班が集まっていますね。森の調査に必要ですよ。Well, there you have it, guys. That's the、um, ending of the Monster Hunter World.、Uh, obviously, there are more quests after this,、uh, before Iceborne, but、um, I will be doing them on my own time and we'll jump straight into Master Rank for the next stream, which is、uh, heading to the Whole Force Reach.、Uh, thank you so much for watching, and this is Cryptocosis signing off. Happy gaming.